you're serious. Just three more jobs until I get fired 50 times in a row. I can't believe my manager just called me off because I sold the games to someone who wanted to destroy them. Other than that, there was this grey wolf I had an argument about iPads and iPhones. He should know that iPhones are bigger than iPads. Don't forget those two hooded brats. And about that kid who wanted to buy a clock, he just refused to get something else. And this time I happened to run into both the Mario brothers, not even helping the thief guy is making me happy. But that's all. As said, this is the 47th time I've been fired. Where should I work next? I'm thinking of getting another job that isn't a restaurant or a store. I'll get a job as a construction worker. OK all construction workers. In a week, we're going to start building a new mall. I'd like it to be done as soon as possible, so try to work your hardest, OK? Sure, but one question. Is there any reason why we're building another mall in the first place? There's like lots of malls in this city. I've been hearing from a lot of people that there has been some guy ruining them by being rude to the customers. That's why we're going to be building one next week. Actually, speaking of which, I heard from my favorite YouTuber Skullshore2GullTCG that an employee was mean to him at Starbucks, one of my favorite places for a coffee. I also heard from my friend Sniffles that the same employee was rude to him at Dunkin' Donuts. I swear, when I get my hands on him, I want to choke him to death. Uh, Handy? You don't even have hands. But because this is Go Animate, bandaged hands are close enough. Oh right. Anyway, while we're talking about this employee, I've heard from Dorothy the cow that the same guy scared her saying he would turn her into a hamburger at Wendy's. That's so vile. I think I can relate to this, because I heard from Toothless and Light Fury that same guy was rude to them at McDonald's, Chuck E. Cheese's, and Burger King. And for my side of the story, I heard from Jack that same employee refused to give him his food at Five Guys. Thank goodness my other son Joey was the manager there and fired him. Okay, we're kind of getting off topic. We need to build a new mall anyway since there's barely any in this area. Wait. Stop right there. One more person wants in on this. Hello there sir. What can we do for you? I would like to get a job as a construction worker here. I want to help you guys with this new mall you're building. Sure. But I have one important question to ask you. Do you have a general equivalency diploma? Oh, um, yes, I do. Okay then. You're hired. But we're going to need supplies to build the new mall. So all of you can go home for the week. OK Levi Ackerman. I hope you're ready for a long day of work. There will be only be breaks during lunch break. Are you ready to start? Yes. I'm ready. So, what do you want me to do? There's a big pile of dirt over there. I want you to use the other bulldozer to move it. After that, I would like you to get the water truck and spread water so dirt doesn't scatter. Sure. Seems simple enough. I'll do those now. OK. That should do it. Now to get the water truck. Here it is. Now I'm going to drive it back to the construction site. Hey T-Bone. What do you say we have lunch together at Nando's later? Nathan, Samster, and many others will be there. Hey, you almost freaking ran us over. Okay. Now that I put all the water needed, the dirt should be damp enough so we can start working. Nice work. Off to a good start I see. Anyway, 
All we need now are the tools so we can start building the mall. The other workers have finished clearing space so we can start soon. All right. I'll be waiting until then. Okay workers. Great job. But now, the real deal begins. Now that we have all the tools, we can start building the mall. Other workers got a bit of it done already, so go help out. How's it going for you back there? It's going fine. It sure is a lot of work, isn't it? I know. We hardly get any breaks. Don't worry, it will be lunch break soon. Then after another three hours, that's it for the day. By the way, before I was hired to this job, I think I heard you mentioning about an employee at Five Guys being rude to what I think you said were two kids. Yeah. One of my sons were Jake. The employee refused to give him his food and that's all. The other one was Joey, who was the one who fired the employee. I see. That Jake sounds familiar, and I don't know who Joey is exactly, but they do remind me of something. But never mind. I'm going back down for a bit. Okay. Oh, hello there. How's it going? Nothing much. Just seeing how everyone's doing. That's nice. Are you going to get back to work? I'll get back to that right away. Hey, can either of you lend us a hand here? I'll help you too. Good job everyone. I'm proud of your hard work. Words can't describe how proud I am. We're almost finished the whole building. Well as much as we want to finish the rest right now, we sure can use a break. You know, now that it's been past three hours, how about we continue this tomorrow and rest for the day? Okay. I will see all of you in the morning. Have a good night. Well, now that everyone's gone home, I wonder what I should do. I know. I wonder what everyone will think if I finished the rest of the building all by myself by the morning. They will be so proud of me. I'm going to finish the job right now. Oh boy. I can't for us to finish the rest of the... Wait, why is the building covered up? It wasn't even finished. Yeah, I clearly don't remember it being finished yesterday. Hello everyone. I'm here. What's going on? Levi Ackerman. I have a feeling you were behind this. Did you seriously stay up all night and finish the rest of the building without our help? Yes. I sure did. The entire mall is up and ready. You don't need to worry about building it anymore. I really don't think you finished it in just one entire night. But if it really is, how about we see it? Okay guys. Levi Ackerman presents to you the new Go Animate Mall. So, what do you guys think? Come on, I want honest opinions. So, um, what do you guys really think? If you put it this way, it's very, hold on, what was I going to say? Oh yeah. It looks like a very bad mall. Wait. It's not bad. It's terrible. I agree. It looks exactly like dog shit. I could have done a better job even with no hands. I'm with you, Daniel and Handy. Besides, there's broken windows, smoke coming out of the building, and other things that appear to be wiped. This proves it's still unfinished. I'm with all of you. And you know something? It's as if this building has to be... Demolished. Levi Ackerman. You're a big disgrace to all the construction workers in the city because of this. Thanks to you breaking the rules, we have to destroy this building and start all over. All because of you. And while we start all over, you're fired. No. I'm sorry. I won't do mistakes like this again. I can fix this. Please don't fire me. We don't care. You should have listened to our boss. 
You remind me of the same employee that Jake and Joey were telling me about actually. That's right. Now take off your construction clothes and get out of here now.